first of all in this video we will calculate the load regulation of a voltage regulator especially so gina diode based voltage regulator so this is a simple circuit of a gina based voltage regulator where we we have used a 12 volts power supply and then there is a series resistor of 100 ohms to gina diode and definitely there is a calculation associated with this uh, so we will leave out of scope of this particular discussion and then there is uh, this gina diode uh, with the breakdown of <coughs> 6.3 volts as per the data sheet and then as we are talking about the load regulation and load regulation is nothing but uh, it's a difference between uh, the no load minus full load by full load we are going to vary the resistor from uh, zero condition or uh, some minimal value condition uh, to a maximum value in steps and uh, <coughs> we are going to um, observe the waveform and then calculate the load regulation. So for this we took a load um, resistor which is variable. So in LT spice any variable value is indicated by the uh, curved brackets and uh, uh, the parameter is included inside. So for example if we take this resistor the value is 100. Here the value is R and this is variable. So two run this variable value uh, with the different values there is something called dot op which is called <coughs> basically um, a spice directive which helps us uh, to define these kind of parameters so for this um, the, the uh, spice directive is dot step pa param p a r a m and then the value which need to be changed r minimum value is 1 because we don't want to give zero and short the load so minimum value is one and maximum value is 1.5 k in steps of 200 so that's how we have um, uh, like uh, defined the spice directive now let us try to simulate the circuit and uh, try to calculate the load regulation so let us try to run this okay so for now we'll just cut this waveform Okay, so what is uh, uh, line regulation, uh, sorry, load regulation as per our formula, load regulation is equal to V, no load, that means zero load, that means open condition by V, full load, that means maximum load, okay, divided by V full load. So this is the formula for uh, the load regulation. So to calculate this we need two scenarios. One is no load and another one is full load or any specific value of the load that you intend to use. So to if you see the circuit this basically is a loaded condition. So if we want to know unloaded condition we have to cut off the load right. So that means this particular node is open, correct? So we are we don't uh, have any load connected, but still there is a node to Gina diode, but load is open. There is no load connected, right? So let us try to simulate this and then try to probe the value. So when we do this, okay, we can see that, okay. Uh, we can see that the voltage is around um, 6.537.269. This is the voltage and let us try to copy this. So under no load condition that is the value. Now what we will do is we will try to connect back the load and uh, try to simulate again and this time uh, this parameter um, the uh, load parameter that we have set right is going to run and when we run this we can see here from um, 200 ohms um, the 
output voltage is seen. Now for this, let us try to have a cursor and let us assume we want a 1k of load. So under 1k, you can see this is the voltage. So if you want to calculate uh, the load regulation, um, so the initial value which we have seen is uh, 0.6539, right? Uh, uh, minus, okay? Let us copy this and divide it by so you can see here uh, around 1.9 percent of uh, load regulation 0.1 percent of load regulation because 0 0.001 uh, which is uh, um, 0 0.1 percent of uh, the <coughs> load regulation that is seen. So this is how we calculate the uh, load regulation um, especially for the um, uh, voltage regulators. So uh, load regulation is one of the parameter, uh, we, one of the specification we said, right, of regulators and this is used uh, as um, one of the important specification uh, to select a regulator. Mm -hmm. Hope uh, we gave a, a glimpse of how um, the uh, load regulation can be calculated. Please post if you have any questions. Thank you.